What's up, Inch Girl? <laughs> it is your coffee girl. Um, I'm just getting up a little late. I got up earlier, but I just I had to go back to sleep, restart my day. This last week was a whole week and like one day of rest, well, partial rest was not going to do it for me. Um, here's Roro. The caffeinated kitty cat. Not really caffeine. I'll give him coffee. He don't need it. Him and his brother do not need any coffee. I swear. Anyway, it's the holidays. I really have not done too many holiday related things this month. Eh, eh, like whether it's just like house stuff. Um, I like to listen to holiday jams. I like to, um, I want to, la, 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 latte. I um you know, I like to go see the Christmas tree downtown. I like there's there's holiday things to do. I just didn't get any of that done <laughs> this year. But you know what? It's okay. It's all right. There's always going to be another time next year. Um, whatever. It's life. There being a anyway. This isn't well. No, it's holiday, so I'm like hot chocolate. Yes, hot chocolate. I. Oh, come on, cat. Back when I was doing the the Starbucks pralines, chestnut praline video, I went to the grocery store. Um, walking in the, down the coffee aisle, I saw this. Um, so, Swiss Myth Cafe, uh, Swiss Myth, <laughs> Swiss Myth, the, Swiss Miss. Jeez, I don't know. Maybe because I'm just getting my day started, I cannot get my words together. I. Anyway, so I got the flavor mocha, and they had caramel macchiato. Um, if you don't know, if you don't know me by now, I have strong opinions about macchiatos in particular, like way, 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 way. Like my one of like my first videos, I was just like I tried Starbucks's cloud macchiato, which is bullshit. All right, kitty, 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 cat. I'm gonna need you to get off my back. Yeah. All right. There we go. Anyway, Starbucks's cloud macchiato. I've really kind of. I mean, besides Starbucks having, like, shit coffee, um, a macchiato, traditionally speaking, traditionally speaking, is a shot of espresso with a, like, a macchiato is a shot of espresso with a dollop of foam on top. That's it. That's all. Maybe a couple more dollops, but there's no milk in it. It's just foam. So whenever I see Starbucks, I'm like, oh, macchiato this, some caramel macchiato that. When people come into my job asking for a caramel macchiato, I'm just like, that's not a macchiato because we will give you a double shot of espresso with some caramel syrup or caramel sauce. Mix that shit up and add some foam on top because we do traditionals here. Um, anyway. So that's why I didn't get the macchiato flavor. I got the mocha. I like a mocha. It says coffee, cocoa coffee blend. Um, reading it. Okay, give me one second. Okay, here's Mento. He, like, everyone's just been dying for my attention. Okay. Um, earlier today, I had to like, handle a situation. And I let the cats like get all my face and my face broke out. So I was just like, I can't do this video now. Um, but, so, on this box, on the very back, it says, Embrace every sip of Swiss Miss with half the caffeine of a cup of coffee. Half. I already have had no coffee this weekend. So, uh, I'm going to have to drink two packs of these. This two packs of this to fill caffeine like fill the caffeine that I need or maybe not it's late in the day it's like what almost four o'clock I don't know <laughs> anyway I like the packaging 
it's it's different compared to the other the cats just like to be on my shoulder oh i'm sorry cat butt um the cats just like to be on my shoulder um mento is bigger than romeo but sacramento is his whole whole name but it's just mento for short um so we do have a box kind of of the original swiss miss hot chocolate so i'm gonna do a little comparison with this um pretty sure it's still good oh it, ex it expired in october oh that's well, hot chocolate it's not gonna be that bad all right so let me make it um okay so i like the packaging it's cute um coffee beans clearly saying that it has coffee in it whoop whoop um more on the coffee itself it says change up your the no, change up change up your routine with a twist of the real swissness cocoa that you know and love i mean swissness makes like the best powdered hot chocolate just saying um with the perfect balance of imported cocoa and caffeine from Real Espresso Swiss Miss Cafe Blends, it's a sweet pick-me-up you need without the caffeine overload. It's a rich, rejuvenating combination that will have you coming back for more. Alright, so that's the deal. Um, so there's an empty into mug, add hot water, or for a richer taste, add milk. I'm going to use milk because milk and hot chocolate is the bee's knees. I mean... It, I'm not knocking like milk with water. I mean hot chocolate with water. Little mother. Mental is really. Anyway. Um, same sitch with this empty cocoa into a mug. Three fourths a cup of water. Um, stir and enjoy. So I'm going to warm up some hot chocolate. So I'm bringing out my Halloween mugs so I can uh, keep track of which one is which. Oh, they even changed up the little package for the, and they already they separate them, which is cool. Because when you get the regular hot chocolate out the box, boom, you gotta tear it in half. Whatever, oh, oh. Create the moment. Oh, I'm about to create a moment. So I got the cafe blend in this one, and I have the regular, regular, um, regular hot chocolate in this one. Excuse my nose. I when I get anxious and stuff, I pick at them, but that's so I don't bite them. Anyway, hot chocolate, a cocoa coffee mix, and turn her around. All right, so here we go. Off that inside the cup. This the hot chocolate one is lighter. Um, also, it's it's just a little it's a little past its best by date, just a little bit. But it's hot chocolate. Um, and this one is darker in color. I don't know if that has anything to do with. Um, yeah, well, it should be the coffee. That's why it's making it darker. Do, do, do. Like, I'm trying to get, like, if I get any, like, coffee aroma from, like, the cocoa powder. I'm not. It just smells like cocoa. No. Uh... There we go. This one does have more like a sweeter smell. I mean, I guess because it has no coffee in it. I guess so. So, um, I thought what would be really fun would be to add some marshmallows to my hot chocolates. Because I really enjoy my marshmallow hot chocolate. I mean, I mean, who doesn't like a nice soft marshmallow? At one point, I'll be eating marshmallows. 
They're so good. Well, especially Jeff. Um, I remember one year I would make marshmallows. Because I like to be a girl who can make all kinds of things. I made marshmallows. And they were so good. And I just ate so many and I made myself sick. Um, but last year, I went to... Was it last year? Last year I went to this holiday market. And they... Um, from my favorite, I'm gonna do some things. Um, from my favorite coffee company, they had a stall. And I was just like, super dope. I'm gonna get something from there. So, not only did I buy coffee, I bought this. Here, oh, ow. <laughs> um, this is where I bought this creme de la creme, uh, Isla Nick. Creme de la creme, Colombia, I'll, no. Creme de la creme, creme de la creme, Colombia, la negrita, from Vigilante. And that, this, mind you, I cut this, but the bag was literally about like this big by yay why. It was like an eight pound bag, not an eight pound, like an eight ounce bag, like a pound. So it was like a pound. My milk's not hot enough. Um, of coffee, and it cost me like almost thirty dollars. Now, mind you, it's Christmas. This is a present to myself, and it was so worth it. It was so good. I mean, I remember one, one time I tried to make enough coffee to like make some for my house, and I did not do the math right, and I messed up a lot of coffee. But. Um, but it was still really worth it. Um, so not only did I get coffee, I got hot chocolate, and they had their hot chocolate. Um, it's like it's already like 8 p.m. I don't need more coffee. I'm not doing anything else. I'm chilling this relaxed time. Um, so I got the hot chocolate, and they offered hot chocolate with these fat a double S marshmallows. I'm talking about like as big as my mouth. That's how big these marshmallows were. And I was just like, oh my gosh. And they toasted them. Like, you don't understand. Like, if you don't have, if you never had a toasted marshmallow before, you need to try it because it is the fucking best. The best. I need to put some fuel on my torch. You can't really, you couldn't really see the flame because I don't have it jacked up all the way. But this might be a twisted marshmallow on this hot chocolate, let me tell you. Okay, so here are we, here we are. Um, again, this is the cafe blend. This is the regular, regular hot chocolate. Um, and here's my hot milk. I'm going to try to not make a whole mess. each I'm gonna pour a little bit in each of them and give them a good stir oh, I always gotta make sure you stir it up if I had both my hands free I probably would have you know not poured as much before I started uh, stirring it so it could be like nice and cool cohesive you know you see how you see that little like I'm trying to break up those lumps I was about to do not a smart move and use the same spoon for both and I would have contaminated my uh, my little experiment my try so I'm going to fin I'm gonna finish these off and then it's time to taste um, another quick thing before I drink, this one is a, is darker, so that might be the coffee at play, and this one, she's just still creamy on top, so there you go, finally, fully mixed, um, I'm not sweating these little granules on top, it is what it is. Alright, so I got my hot chocolate mixed up. Now it's time to taste thing. I feel like I look a little rough. 
It's Sunday. I don't care. Okay, so we got our regular regular. We're going to do this as our control. Um, again, it she's she's a little past the expiration date, a little bit. But you know what they say? It's it's dried. It, it should it has more time to before it's. I mean, if it was something like with fresh milk and everything, I would not. <laughs> I would not touch it because I just nope. I'm doing it. Good. Solid. Hot chocolate. Um easily you can drink this. Um so no complaints there. It's good. But what I'm really for, what I'm really here for, it's the cocoa one. Because again, girl hasn't had coffee all weekend. Let's see what it do. Oh. It's there. Oh, no. Mm -mm. Okay, the coffee is there, but not in the best way. Like, so let me, I'm, let me uh, pick this. Pick this thing up real quick. You read some uh, instant espresso coffee. Hydrogenated coconut oil. Okay, instant espresso. Um, so again, if you haven't seen like my instant coffee video, go watch that because it was not great. It was actually I still got the the shit right here. Not it. Um. Yeah, it's like you can taste the coffee. You can t you know it's it's there for sure. So it really doesn't, it lost a lot of it's like, so it says, how do I explain this? It's not the best. I mean, it's cute. It tastes like coffee, but it's just like something about it just, just doesn't really scream like the, the, something about it like definitely has it tastes like instant coffee now they say espresso i think instant espresso is a little bit different um well it is a little bit different it's supposed to be stronger but this right here nah, it's because like i've as someone who's like put chocolate in their coffee put chocolate in their latte so i'm gonna say that this is like supposed to give me like mocha vibes like it's just shot of espresso with your chocolate sauce, um, or chocolate, your, your chocolate sauce. Here you go. Hey, bro. Um, so it, do, it definitely gives you like that coffee vibe, but like the coffee that you don't really like, coffee that you don't really like, <sighs> but you're still drinking it because it tastes all right. But it's just like, hmm. Like, it's, it's just not doing it for me. What do you think, bro? Does it smell okay? Yeah, so, it's not really doing it for me. Like, I really, I had high hopes because Swiss Miss makes the best hot chocolate. Um... But yeah, this is not, that's not great. It's, it says no artificial sweeteners, flavors, preservatives, or colors. Yeah, it's just, I, I had high hopes for this, but it's just not doing it for me. Maybe like the macchiato one. 
would have been better, sweeter, I guess. It's like Swiss Miss is generally like a sweeter, like hot. This is it's a sweet hot chocolate, especially when you use it with milk. Um. So that was that. I am getting ready to toast myself a marshmallow if I can get it together. So, <laughs> being as though I've never used my uh, my torch before, she was torching like a lot, and I almost didn't know what to do. Okay, cat. Anyway, um, pro tip, if you ever use something like this, always take your time. I was a little distracted with the cat being on my shoulder. That was dangerous. Never do something like that again because I couldn't really control what I was doing. I'm using a very dangerous thing. So, I am partially a professional when it comes to handling um, utensils and such. But still, be careful, pay attention, make sure you read directions because... I could have lost a dread eyebrow or something else today. So, torch. Okay, now I know that this is turning off and this is releasing the gas. I'm going to turn it a little bit more. There we go. We got a soft flame. I don't need nothing more than a soft flame because I just want a nice, perfectly toasted marshmallow. There we go. Just get in there. Again, this is just me being a little extra. Get get her all like. Turn it, turn it off. Turn it all the way off. There we go. Good shit. Anyway, um, I dropped that thing in my regular hot chocolate because it was better. Swiss Miss, I don't know what you're doing, but this just does not do it for your girl. As someone who drinks coffee every day, I mean, I don't really drink hot chocolate like that. That's like I don't enjoy a hot chocolate. But I've, I've always had Swiss Miss. Swiss Miss is the superior, well, I haven't tried a lot, so I won't say like superior, but it's pretty fucking good. You know, it's pretty fucking good hot chocolate. Um, but I need coffee in it. Nope. Not for me. <laughs> Not today. Um, but yeah, and I have a whole box of this, so I'm just going to gift it to people. I'm just like, here you go. Um, because it's the holidays. I didn't really get a chance to do too much. And uh, I don't want that to go to waste. Because I don't really see myself drinking it. Again. Because it just doesn't do it for me. I'd rather just drink regular hot chocolate. Because that, that tastes like it's like coffee with some chocolate in it. But it's just, it's not great. So, it's been a girl. Uh, this has probably been a pretty long video. I got cat scratches on my back. Because the cats want to be on my back. Bro, you want to say bye? Alright. Until then. We'll see ya. When we see ya. Just roll the coffee cat. JK. Alright. Y'all have a good one. Us. Again. I'll see you when I see ya. Until then. Cheers. Roll the roll. No.